Hello babies, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'll be revamping and restyling this hair. So this hair came in as a wavy hair and my client suggested that I return its loose waves. So guys, stay tuned as you watch me revamp this hair and bring it back to life. So I first started off with detangling the hair with my brush then after detangling I had to use some warm water so guys please if you're revamping a hair blend be sure to use warm water make sure the water is not that hot because if the water is very hot it can spoil the hair this is not a human hair so this is me adding extra cold water because i found that the water was hotter than i wanted it to be so this is me washing the hair very well with a moisturizing shampoo so guys when washing a wig be it closure wig or a frontal wig be sure to wash the lace you know concentrate very well on the lace because sometimes there is usually product build up on the lace either the lace frontal or the lace closure another thing that i want to point out here is this while trying to wash your wig please don't squeeze your wig the way you squeeze clothes okay if you do that it's going to make it sponge just squeeze it downwards don't squeeze it so vigorously the way you would squeeze clothes leaving this place the sun's about to break you're riding shotgun the feeling will change so babies now that i'm done washing the hair i'll go ahead and mix my hair repair treatment i'll be mixing up my moisturizing conditioner and i'll also be adding my protein keratin treatment to it i already added it to the container of camera and also i'll be adding my oil my revon oil guys you guys saw the hair before i started washing it it was looking so dry and worn out so this mixture right here is going to make it is going to return it back to its glory it's going to restore the hair the hair will be looking nice and smooth and shiny so babies when applying this mixture be very generous with it like i said you can use any other type of moisturizing conditioner but be sure to add at least one protein treatment you can use the keratin treatment you can use a hair mayonnaise you can use any other form of protein treatment but this is to ensure that the hair returns back to its original look okay babies so if you've made it this far and you're just coming across my channel for the first time please kindly hit that subscribe button and leave a comment down below and also give this video a thumbs up thank you Okay, so now that I'm done applying the mixture, 
I'll go ahead and tie it in a ziplock bag or a nylon or just a plastic wrap like this. I'll tie it and leave it for 8 good hours. Okay guys, so this is the wig after leaving it for 8 hours. You can see how soft and shiny it's looking already. <laughs> oh my god. You guys have no idea how soft this hair suddenly became after applying the hair repair treatment. So I'll go ahead and rinse it and then detangle it more with my wild tooth comb. Okay, so I actually allowed it to dry a bit and then now I'm going to be returning its loose waves You know, I told you guys that this hair came in as a wavy hair so I'll be using my bending rods or flexi rods whichever one you call it to give it this wave you know I don't know what to call it I don't know the name but I think this is a loose waves so this is actually how I am setting it guys you can you can use and I'm using the medium size of this flexi rod but you can actually use the small size or use the bigger size depending on how full you want the hair to be so me I just want the hair to just be that you know not so full and not scanty so that's why i am going for this medium sized flexi road okay guys so when you get to the extreme you need to wrap in the opposite direction this is because when you finally remove when this finally dries and you remove the flexi rods it needs to look as though the other ones too are in the same direction with this one because if you do it in the other direction it's going to look off i don't know if you guys understand but once i loosen this you'll get to know what i am talking about Okay baby, so I went ahead and did the rest of camera and now I'll be sun drying it for 48 hours. Okay guys, so this is the hair after sun drying it for 48 hours. So now I'll be unraveling it gently. My client said I should just leave it like that after unraveling it. I shouldn't comb it out. But guys, you can actually go ahead and comb out your waves or your curls, whatever you call it, after unraveling the hair from the flexi rod. So this is me doing that gently. so guys i'm almost done unraveling this can you can you look at that beauty I, 
see how shiny this hair looks see how smooth this hair looks and i didn't even add an extra oil to this hair but look at how shiny and healthy and it's looking so pink it's looking so it looks like something that was just resurrected you know so this is me doing the final i think this is the final one and i will go ahead and fix up the closure of course i'm not going to leave the closure like that so i'll be using my hot comb and my heat protectant spray to flatten the closure so that the closure will look all sleek and laid down if i'm having a good time don't you blame me if it's feeling now god's making me crazy making me crazy so babies this is the final look and now i'll be packaging it and getting it ready for shipment thank you guys for watching see you next time bye Drive, drive, drive.